Ho 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 and welcome to the show. No, I'm not doing that. It's December. Whoopity whoopity. You know what that means? That it gets really hot in New Zealand. I'm quite sunburnt right now. Makes me look like I'm really tired, but don't worry, I'm fine. So today I'd just like to talk to you about Christmas and answer some Christmas type questions and just just sort of talk about what does the thing that does the Christmas thing. You explained that well, good job. So it's finally time to grow the Christmas hat. <laughs> Hey, let me get that nice, let me get it nice. So dawn your Christmas hats, bake up a batch of eggnog and buy your friend a Christmas present at the last minute because you forgot about it. Because it's time to get festive. Question one. When do you start getting excited about Christmas? The only time that it's acceptable to get excited about Christmas when it's Christmas. I think the limit is December 1st. Honestly, just people putting up their decorations in September. What the heck are you doing? Come on. Do you still have advent calendars? Yes, I do. Candle. Nothing says Christmas quite like a cheap chocolate candle. What are your favorite Christmas films? Mickey's Christmas Carol has always been a big one for me. A lot more recently, Charlie Brown's Christmas, The Jim Carrey Christmas Carol, Elf, The Grinch. The Grinch was a big one. Me and my sister watched The Grinch so much that my mum actually hid the VHS Grinch tape that we had somewhere and told us that it got broken because she was so sick of watching it. Mum, I love you, but come on, it was one of my favourite movies. <laughs> Any funny Christmas memories? This one's sort of about Christmas and sort of not. My sister used to come into my room when I was about mm, yeah, five or six, too young to know any better, and she would say, Angus, it's Christmas tomorrow. Really? No. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah. Talk us through your typical Christmas day. So usually I get up ridiculously early, open up my stocking, look through all that stuff, think that's really cool, get ready for church, go to church, come home, open the rest of the presents with the rest of the family, then we have this family that comes round every Christmas. They come round, we exchange gifts, we do something the whole day, usually we play a board game, we may watch a movie at the end of the day, we have Christmas lunch and dinner and trifle is usually a big thing in our family. Then I stay up super super late on the internet as I do every single night. Yeah, only this time it's festive. <sighs> I'm really tired. What do you want for Christmas dinner? Typically there's some sort of meat on the table, usually ham. If not, there'd be some turkey or some chicken or, you know, poultry. Always a bit of carrots, always a bit of broccoli. Roast potatoes, man. I love me some roast potatoes. Which are your favourite Christmas songs? Snoopy's Christmas has always been my favourite Christmas carol. Christmas bells, Christmas bells. I don't know, what jingle bells? What other good ones are there? What is the best Christmas present you have ever received? This. I mean, right now, at the moment, it's sort of outdated, and I don't really use it for editing anymore, but when I got it, it gave me the means to create videos and do what I love and all that stuff. So, nah. Love you, Mum and Dad. Real or fake Christmas tree? Fake. We've had this Christmas tree for as long as I can remember, and I've slowly outgrown it. A lot of good memories with this this tree. This favorite Christmas ornament. This thing. Look at it. <laughs> that was a really gross laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Having performance issues. It's an old tree. Give us some slack. And that is the Christmas vlog. Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. The happy. Everything else? Adios, amigos. Feliz Navidad. That's as much Spanish as I know. Is it Spanish? I don't know, I probably offended someone. Sorry!